Today, we will be talking about quantum physics, which I, I read about them, of course, and it's complicated, but um, it, it's fun to know about the universe, right? About space, about the quarks, and about all the amazing things about the universe, right? There's so many things that are incredible, right? Uh, we human, I think, for the longest time, wonder if there's another universe now there ha there have been saying um I was a, it was a like news and there's um a black hole which can, uh, either like a it lose energy over time it says or something i don't remember but it said that it came from another universe i was like hmm so we humans are always curious if there's an existing life force uh out there <clears throat> Any life force hearing my voice right now in the ether of vibration, connect with me, okay? Like, seriously, like, adopt, adopt me and, like, bring me to your leader, okay? <laughs> okay? I mean, most people, like, you know, want to be adopted. I don't want to be able to, come on, man, that's be, like, ingenious right there. And also, give me your powers. I want your powers. I want your brains i want to i want to like build like freaking spaceship or like do warping like go through uh wormholes and out shoot out the gate and then going back into the uh wormhole and see if where i can go with this i wonder if there's like a universe where a superman or power ranger exists okay it exists here with the creation of movies and stuff but i wonder if all the creation that mankind or humans have been creating uh movies and stuff i wonder if it's real i wonder what's out there i wonder if there's an alien that look like the predator <laughs> right or like autobots roll out like transformer anyway where did the theory come from? Technically, these theories come from... Uh, they said Max Planck, right? 1900s. Publishing his theory of the world as burst of uh, energy called quanta. Experiment on the quantum level showed that matter exists as a probabilities and tendency rather than absolute things. Reality may not be so real or solid after all. Yeah, I put more. Here we go. Quantum physics, a discrete quality of electromagnetic energy stuff around the world is made of when we, what what world is made of, when we reduce it to its essence. Study of things that happen on the very small scale of the force that um, underline our physical reality or world. Long road to uh, a unified theory. This is it, where uh, where does this come from? It came from the uh, book Divine Matrix from what's his name? Uh, I, I love him, uh, Go, uh, Greg Bordon. Sound like Zordon. Uh, I keep thinking about Power Rangers. Field of energy, provide the container, reflect the fact that this field exists in everything from the smallest particle of the quantum atoms to the dis uh, distant. Galaxy who light is just now reaching our eyes and, and it's everything between changes It's what we've been believe about our role in creation. We are more than an observer We're creative of our own universe mirror of our own truest unconscious belief instead of existing or being powerless we can Participate in creating our own life just by acting choosing the life we want now. I believe that there is a power, right, that by choosing or by making a decision that the universe will guide you into the direction of your dream. Just the decision uh, that move you to that point in time. And since we're, you know, a lot of people love law of attraction and when it comes to quantum physics, I know that they love it because... It deal with the energy that is inside and outside. It's everywhere. It's combined with and through us, right? This field of energy it exists uh, uh, through eons, right? Some people don't believe it. Some people believe it. Who knows? But can we really tap into this power 
create the life that we want. More, most often say we can't. Some say we can. That's the mysterious thing. If if you don't believe it, then nothing will happen for you. That's just the factor. But also, oftentimes, it's you know I I like um, reading books on the universe, like uh, by Brian Greene. Um, but it's a little bit harder. Uh, but it helped me to understand where special relativity or general relativity who created it. It was created by Albert Einstein. And, and people consider him a genius. But maybe back then they thought he was crazy, right? Now he's a genius. Most heroes, most legends, most um, um, geniuses thought that uh, people thought they were crazies, man. So... If the world that we live in is just a a finite of energy that vibrate at a certain level of frequency, that's why I attract a lot of people into this. Because some people or some people also believe that the energy that inside them can be able to channel. Some people are afraid of channel um, or the word channel because. You know, we live in a world that try to run away from who we truly are. That's why I like anime. Uh, most people hate on anime or cartoon. I love anime. You know why? Because it make interesting. It make things interesting, man. Like the way that, like when people talk about channeling, anime make it make it more funner. Like there's if you're into shamanism or shaman. I highly recommend watching uh, anime uh, called Shaman King. Even if you think it's childish, you will have fun watching it because it's like freaking uh, turning a fucking. Uh, sorry, I, I curse on this, but it's like taking a spirit and a samurai, a dead samurai, a legend dead samurai, and turning that into into your body, and you get to fight with that spirit, or like uh, like take your sword that you have, like a katana or a broadsword, and you say, Aminamaru! Into the sword! And then you, like, you, you have the skills to wield the power of a samurai. Like, that's so cool. And also, they have, um, I know that every version of this, that they have Bruce Lee in it, right? This anime had Bruce Lee in it. They call it Lee Pai Long. Lee Pai Long, right? It's Bruce Lee, basically. I summon the spirit Amitamaru into the sword. Yeah, I, I just want to say that. But Shaman King is pretty amazing. It make shamanism amazing. Like, it make you want to become a shaman. Like, seriously. Why am I talking about this? Because it's the law of attraction. Like, it's energy. It's, But, I know it's fun, but there's other things that we need to know. The skill set we need to develop. That's why I always bring expert on here. To banish the belief that we have. <sighs> I just want to change the way that law of attraction think. Anyway, uh, I know people say it's my opinion. Eh, the way I say it, Hardcore fans. I'm a hardcore fan of the Love Attraction. But anyway, the way that we connect with... I was thinking about that. If we're truly part of the universe, we already have this connection with this power. Think about it. Like, we're like a solar system. We have, like, system... Well, I don't know much about it. I'm not scientific, so... But there is... A power within it that generate energy, right? Especially our heart, right? But the magnificent of a human being has the potential to do amazing things. You see over and over again, you hear the story how something happened uh, uh, to the individual just for the individual. Because they're not just the observer. They participate in this creation because they know that they they lock something an idea into this infinite possibilities and they hone that into it and they make things possible because they believe that they can 
not why they don't think they can. Yes, you will fail. Yes, you will have failure. Yes, you will be. Some people are not afraid. Some people are afraid. It is how you adjust, how you move forward, even though life. People say life doesn't happen to you. Life happens for you. Well, I don't know that yet. I'm not a genius. Oh, uh, okay. I did say I was a genius, but I'm not talking about what we feel inside. What we can grab, right? If we can generate this power within us, then imagine as if your energy is a wave in motion. It's like a uh, ripple into the uh, um, ether of the universe. And it draw a powerful force to come into you. It doesn't matter where. It can be the... I mean, we have technology now where we're so connected using the internet or using Wi-Fi. It's just like speed of light, right? And bam, we're connected. Texting, whatever, right? Okay, guys. That's it for quantum physics. Oh, yeah. Did I read that? It's the act of making a choice that we create our life. But most of the time, we make that choice consciously. Bam. Make your choice consciously. Subscribe to my channel. Like my video. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.